I was working one summer um, and I get this call from, from Steve Jansen. I'm working out at Trinity, I need you to come and rebound, get some shots up, we're doing a thing. I was like, okay, like this sucks. Nobody likes to rebound. But I went there and I rebounded for him and he had an incredible workout. He made like 30, 40 threes in a row. And I remember leaving that workout going like, wow, like dad, like, I didn't know that anybody could shoot that well. You know, and, and he's like, well, Merrick, Steve's making good money overseas. Like you could do that one day if you wanted to be a pro, if you wanted to work hard enough. And I was like, okay. You know, I, I kind of set myself, I'm like, oh, I'm doing it. I'm going to be a pro. I'm going to set my goals like that. And so for you guys, uh, it might not be your dreams, might not to become a pro, um, but for sure, what I think you guys should do, if you guys really love the game of basketball, you should try and make it into a, into a college education. Try and make it pay for your college education. For me, it's like being able to give back to the community, being able to tell the kids that are at this camp saying, hey, like, if you have the work ethic, if you have the connections, you can make it. You know, you gotta wanna be in the gym and work in early hours, but it also takes good character. You know, it also takes good values. It also takes being a good teammate and learning the game from different perspectives. All these coaches are coming here today, volunteering six, seven hours of their time to, to come and coach these kids for free because they believe in that too. They wanna help the grassroots. Just to be the vehicle that has, has been able to take these brands and, and deliver them to the kids and say like, guys, like, here's some free stuff for you to go home with. And at the same time, you know, you're not paying for this camp. So what an awesome opportunity to say like, look, we're loving on you guys. We want you to succeed. We really do. Like, we honestly want you guys to make it. And we want to take pride in our city. And uh, I'm just super happy that that's, that's kind of come to fruition.